<laughs> you can't pull them further apart, huh? I wonder if they got. I wonder if the previous user broke them. <laughs> it's it's delicate work, isn't it? So you've got that clamp. Take them, take them all the way out, and we'll see if we can yeah, fix them, and then put them back in there. Yeah, they're not open. Oh, did the little? I wonder if they only open it. So you you have to have wow. the camera person has it plays a big role as well yes. to okay. make sure once that once they're closed, they don't in the right area, yeah. and then so that you're not looking at something the wrong open. way and all that. Yeah, yeah. Are they? Yeah, they're, they're just broken. And close. Once, yeah. once they're open, they're open. They're, they've been beat up. We have high school students come in here and play with these things. Will yeah. these work? Yes, but I get the idea. Oh my goodness. You can put a clip applier in. That'll work. That's Try this, Carol. Yeah. Now what is this? Clip applier. This is a clip applier. So if there was a blood vessel, um, oh. we have to clip it. So go ahead and squeeze it once. Okay. Okay. And then I'm gonna break everything again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No. Oh, let's see. Is that locked? Oh, maybe. Is there a unlock? Yeah, no, I can't. Hmm. Are you qualified to use those? Yeah. <laughs> hey, President, how are you? Good to see you. Good to see you. We've, we've, you know, <laughs> thank you. Yes, it is. It is. <laughs> it's, uh, I just went up a notch in my book because I've done it too. Uh, Leopold Kiss. <laughs> Yeah, just uh, Saturday was the one shot. So, oh what's that? Yeah, I and I, I knew I hit because I saw blood immediately. Okay, so this is. Yeah, just no, just on this side. <laughs> so we'll put you in here, and we'll try and get. You go ahead, sweetie. You you gotta. Now see that pink Brooks at the bottom of your screen? Uh huh. That's our little foam stomach. So, back up. What do you got there, Carol? Uh, I got a little thing. Here, Misty, do you want to run the camera? Brooks, can she have a turn at the camera? Oh, am, yeah, I go to, for it. am I supposed to go Joe, in Joe, have there? you tried this? Oh. Pretty, oh. pretty amazing. Okay. So, the foam stomach is a little higher. So, maybe if we get you to go along now. This is great, isn't it? Yeah. Have you not? Have you been up to the third floor yet? No. Yeah, we just opened that up. That was the, the anyways, we had open house a couple of weeks ago, but um, when we built this building, um, because construction was so affordable at the time, we said, let's put a third floor, shell it in, and leave it that way. And, uh, and sure enough, in a couple of years, we said, we need to fill that out, and we actually need to expand into it. And we were able to do it for less than a million bucks. I mean, so oh, the price that's amazing. It's wonderful, and it's full already, but... Oh, um, it's wonderful. Kathy's program, and then we have a sonography program that um, has a lab downstairs and a physical therapist assistant program are nationally recognized and one of the few in the region, really. So, really? Yeah. Oh, that is wonderful. What a great thing for students. I mean, uh, that are in the program. Oh, what a great recruitment tool. I mean, this is this is fabulous. It is, and I, I don't know where all our students who are here right now came from, but we are pulling a lot of kids out of Colorado who are coming up here oh, to do I would this. Imagine. The, the cost and the backlog of access down there. Yeah. Hi, Judy. Oops. Judy, I don't know that you've met our governor, yeah. Governor Matt Mead, Judy Hayes. Hi, I'm Matt. It's nice to meet you. Thank she you. She's our new vice president of student services. Oh, very good. Uh, very good. Week on the job. She got one in. <laughs> What'd you do, Carol? <laughs> she got a little pigtail tack in the stomach. Oh, very good. Is that healthy? <laughs> when you're trying to secure mesh in for a hernia, it's very healthy. <laughs> oh, very good. A natural talent, huh? Yeah. Well, yeah. Apparently, she is a natural <laughs> talent. That's very good. So this is the hands-on lab. This is where they learn all their skills that they're going to need before they go to surgery. And uh, they have to be safe before we can send them off to the hospital. This is great. So have you, have you got two of these uh, stations? Um, actually, they're teaching people how to do ski, uh, stick sponges and skin staples oh. and things like that. Very good. Students, somebody come over and talk to her just in oh. <laughs> Hello. 
Oh, that's this is all right. <laughs> so, so tell me what we got here. These are, this is called ray tech. This blue in here, so if it's left in the body, it's x-rayable. Oh. So they'll see this on so the this is what they, we see them get like mm -hmm. blood? Yeah. Blood. And then we, we, this is called a Forrester sponge stick. And there's some grooves in there. And it's made to hold these on to go mm. into the cavities to, mm. you know, damp up yeah. things, dry things out. So a anything that like this would have this, what do you call this in here? It's uh, the Raytech. Raytech. Uh huh. So that so you can check, make sure you didn't leave anything. And even in. our uh, well, there was some laparotomy sponges. A lot of the other sponges that we have has has blue on it as well. Mm. These ones right here. Oh, so the so same concept. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So that way, and then we have different folds. For, to put these on, it, and it all depends on the doctor's preference or even our own preference. But you want to make sure that the, the Raytex stays out. This mm -hmm. one's called the diaper fold. Okay, got that. <laughs> and you put that in. So. And then you fold them in. Got your finger. So that's this. Mm -hmm. So you have to learn all these instruments the folds yes sir mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and over here is uh, week five of our our fifth week of instruments um, this is the Belfort retractor it's put in to kind of separate is that chest not not so much chest more abdomen mm -hmm. and there's uh, different tools that you can attach to that with that uh, lug nut there that uh, you can move the organs out of the way to get mm. to deeper organs there's different kinds of uh, forceps this one is more for the bell because inside, the bell is so sensitive. So inside it's a lot smoother. Oh, yeah. And there's actual rubber things that they can put on this too, as well. There's all kinds of drains. Hmm. So what, so you have a lot of practical tests, right? Oh, yes. Uh, I mean, you, once you've every gotta, week. You've got to mm -hmm. identify all these. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And then do you have a... Um, sort of a pressure test where somebody's yelling get me such and such clamp uh, you, I'm sure not right now just because right. we've started but I'm sure towards the end closer we'll to have some sort of mm -hmm. yeah. I know a lot of the um, mannequins that we have you know they are set in with computers that give us situations you know a code and, or and is this a mannequin here yes and what how oh yeah mm -hmm. And and they can they can simulate like a low bl bl blood pressure or something like that. Yeah, yep, yep. And there's a underneath these drapes. There's a right here. That's to kind of show us. This is called a stoma. Uh -huh. That's what they leave on the outside for like after colostomy surgeries, uh -huh. for the the bowel to right. come out. So you know it gives us a way to sh to see what we're going to be doing. Wow. You know, being able to sew, to tie, to cut, to Pretty much everything. So, how does the the program work in terms of after you're through here? Do you do they start integrating into an actual hospital situation? Uh, yeah, a lot of I, I know the last year students, a couple of them had had job offers before they even graduated. Because huh? in the state of Wyoming, unfortunately, you don't have to be certified, which is a really sad thing. Because this is extremely extensive patient care mm -hmm. and to not be certified is a really sad thing but this, the, there's such a high demand for us right and such a low output right. of the surgical tech how does how long does it take to get through a surgical tech program uh, this here? program at LCCC is a 10 month program, ten month program. And the prereqs, all the prereqs have to be finished before you enter the program and then do you have an occasion during the program to actually go to a, a live surgery so you're see whether you Ab well, even before, faint or even not. Even before we apply, we have no. to go and observe uh, and four if, hours if worth you of can, surgery. If you can, mm -hmm. wow. So all of us girls have been able to observe and... And not <laughs> pass out? No, well, I've been a CNA for 10 years. Oh, so, so you're been, used yeah. to it. Yeah. So, and I, I went, I was actually going to do nursing, oh. you know, just an easy transition, and I, Kathy suggested that I go and observe a surgery just to see if I'd be interested, and I fell in love. Yeah. Well, oh, you've got a leg up being with yeah, your CNA work, huh? It was, it's a wonderful profession. Yeah. Well, uh, high, uh, high pressure it sort is, of deal. It is. It is. And I'm, I'm willing to take that role. Oh, good. I'm glad. I'm glad. Very good. That well, was very nice talking to you. Well, you guys are nice to share this with me. Oh, we love it. We all enjoy it. Pretty fascinating. It, it really Lucky. is. And what's wonderful about it is every day is something different. Every hour is something different. Mm. 
So th it's designed so that whatever you would do in surgery, you can replicate here in so at some level, other than Absolutely. the live body. Absolutely, other than the, the, the live patient. Uh. But next semester we go and do clinicals, so then, we w then we'll put all of the stuff that we learned here into real life situations, uh. which Very is good. really awesome. That is awesome. So then we're that is awesome. Prepared in more than Thanks, you guys. Appreciate it. Thank, Thank you. you. Best of luck to you. Sure, come on over. We can, uh, hey Tony, you want to come help us here a minute? We get more people in here. <laughs> so I get a mask on for this? You want me to have a mask on? <laughs> no, that's fine. We want to recognize you. Oh, Brooke, do you have my phone? Okay, awesome. <laughs> come in. Either one. <laughs> Oh, yeah. you're nice. My son thinks I'm eating someone for this. No. <laughs> you are. So now I get to say I, I saw did. where it said endoscopy on there and I thought, oh my god. Oh, you just hold it down a long time. The very top. We are. We are. I am. <laughs> <laughs> Yep, 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 yep. Right. Oh, I should be hugging. Thank you, ladies. Thank yeah. you. Best of luck to you. Yeah, thanks thank for taking you. the time with me. I appreciate it. Well, thank you. So, J Joe Carroll had some success in there, so next time I cut myself open, I'm going to let, just let her do the stitches. <laughs> oh, I bet you could. <laughs> Well, should we get you set up for the proclamation? Sure. Actually, when I was here earlier, and I told him that you're such a great guy that you might be willing to volunteer to. It, <laughs> I, uh, I've been so ripped up, they couldn't do anything to damage me, really. <laughs> oh, no, you know, that's the, they tell me there's two categories, those that have done it and those that are going to do it. So might as well get it, get it done. You probably have done it. A whole bunch of cuts. Oh, yeah. a little bit. Did you get the beat up boxing? Did you ever get any bad eye cuts? Okay. <laughs> Carol, come read the proclamation and I'll sign it. You, you, you read it. <laughs> okay, very good. So there's where the camera is. We'll have the students gather around you. Absolutely, get the students in here. Yeah. President, you better get over here. We got everybody we need. Two, three, four. I think that's it. Don't you want to get that class? No thanks, mommy. I'll stay out. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, mommy. <laughs> Governor's proclamation. Whereas surgical techs are a critical part of the team of medical practitioners committed to providing surgical care to patients, and whereas surgical technologists assist surgeons in the delivery of quality care in the operating rooms of hospitals. And whereas surgical technologists are entrusted with the responsibility for the lives of their patients under their care who are neighbors, families, and friends, now therefore I, Matthew H. Mead, Governor of the State of Wyoming, do hereby proclaim September 16th through the 22nd, 2012 as Surgical Technology Week in Wyoming, and ask our citizens to join me in acknowledging the important role the surgical technologists play in the care and recovery of their patients. Yay. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, yeah. <laughs>
Well, thank you very much. I will tell you, it's a, an impressive program, President. And, uh, you know, as, as much as I've been torn apart, it is nice to know we've got some real experts coming up to help put us all back together. So, well, now we're yeah. delighted to be here, and we wish you all the best of luck. So, uh, and I uh, hope you just have a wonderful career. Uh, President, congratulations. Uh, what a wonderful facility. Thank you. Uh, and if I was. If I had any skill and was uh, had an inclination to get in this, this would be where I'd want to go. This is just wonderful, so well, thank you. Thank you, and thank you both for coming. We have some top-notch faculty like Kathy and some top-notch students, too. So, yes. um, no. If you're ever at that end of uh, the service, uh, you know, ask the folks that are working on you or if you ever need to get stitched up for any reason. <laughs> <laughs> there's, a, there's a good chance they came from one of our programs. Very right, good. Kathy? Yes. Kathy, let me give you the signing pen, and you can keep that with a proclamation. And yeah, very good. And we'll be sending the pictures on to our National Association because they collect photos of Surge Tech Week, and this is this is an amazing feather in our cap. Good. Governors don't come to Surge Tech Labs and come. Well, I so I'm glad I did. I enjoyed getting the opportunity to mess around there. <laughs> I'm sorry I, I broke two things, but <laughs> we'll send you a bill. <laughs> I'm sure you will. <laughs> Thank you. So Thank you. Really Thanks. Well, time. you're nice to take the time. Thank you Thank again. You so much. Best of luck to all of you. Thank you. Good luck to all of you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Oh my gosh, you mic'd up even, huh? Yeah. We don't mess around over here. You know, when they had me on lunch and I'm up this weekend, that's what the one shot you got all the pressure so what's the one shot I don't it's a, it's a it's been going on for some years very nice and it's called uh, and you get one